We begin tonight with a preteen driver joyriding in a stolen forklift through the city of Ann Arbor. Thank you so much for joining us for 7 Action News at 6. I'm Mike Duffy. Ann Arbor police tell us that a 12 year old boy was behind the wheel and police say that he took the 35,000 pound construction vehicle from an Ann Arbor middle school and drove it for an hour through the city and across the M14 bridge. 7 Action News reporter Sarah Michaels joins us from where the whole fiasco started at Forsyth Middle School and she explains how the child got access to the equipment and the amount of damage he caused. Ann Arbor police tell me that on Saturday, a 12 year old boy found a key hidden inside the cab of an unlocked forklift here at Forsyth Middle School. So what do you do? Well, he revved that forklift up and took it on an over hour long joy ride through Ann Arbor. Crazy experience. I was like, what is going on? Soon after the busiest game of the year ended in Ann Arbor Saturday, hundreds of people across the city like Musa Basil started to see this a forklift followed by multiple police cars taking a joy ride through the city. I figured some like Ohio State guy or some Michigan guy that was drinking a lot just were having fun and stole a forklift. They weren't. Ann Arbor police confirm it was a 12 year old manning the wheel of this construction genie GTH 636. Police first tried to stop the child in a neighborhood at 648, but the driver wouldn't stop. They say they followed him through different parts of Ann Arbor for a while where he hit 10 parked cars. Police tell us that he was driving for over an hour. I mean, I'm just a little surprised that he was managed to operate that and was able to get the keys to that and then start it. I'd just kind of shocked. As they tailed the 12 year old, police tell me they use lots of emergency lights and sirens to make sure other drivers were warned. The Washtenaw County Sheriff's Office picked up part of the pursuit when the driver went across the M14 bridge. He finally stopped at 753 in the area of M14 in Gottfredson, about 15 miles from where he started. Thankfully, nobody was hurt. How dangerous could this have been? Oh, this could have been incredibly dangerous. It's a large vehicle. It weighs as much as 35,000 pounds. It's got these giant forks on the front of it. When police took the child from Ann Arbor into custody, they say that he was upset and a little scared. It's not the first time the 12 year old driver has had a run in with officers, but they're hoping it will be the last. And so it's kind of our hope that this will really be a catalyst to make sure they get kind of the treatment or help they need as an entire family to, to prevent something like this from happening again. Normal day on a uh, crazy game day in Ann Arbor. In Ann Arbor, Sarah Michaels, 7 Action News. Okay, Sarah, thank you.